Welcome back, welcome back. Another episode of War Tide. As the king learns I did about this the mission off stones, camera by accident. A smile creeps across his lips. So I'm gonna do it again on camera. So that you all can see it also. Uh got the stream seen it, but you all didn't, so um I'm just let it read out again and and do it. As the king learns about the Thunderstones, a smile creeps across his lips. Ye gods, before you saved me, I saw those stones in an English monastery. With the Anglo forces still lurking on the island, your fellowship sets forth on a new quest. Spotting the Viking ship in the distance, the Anglo soldiers stand ready to welcome the visitors with the edges of their blades. Fix my headphones here. Uh, let's see, I can retard it. Runestone. Reach the monastery and retrieve the secret runestone. Into the tower and raise your banner. Okay. Get them off. She gonna stay in the back. Okay, so that's gonna start it. Let's get them prepared. Put them there. Put her here. Alright, so he's gonna defend, she's gonna attack from the rear, and then both of them are just offense, hopefully they'll kill him fast enough. Let's get it going. Like that. Uh, put him on fire. Volley. Get here. Go there, get the high ground. You go up here. Oh, you let this nigga. No. You go there. Back her up. Fire. Get the high ground. Alright. You go down. I meant to go here instead, but you fire, shoot him in the back. And you attack him from a distance. Good job. Okay, so I go up to the left. That's gonna go up around that tower. The right. Okay. Let's go over here, get them out the way. She took a lot of damage that time because I wasn't paying attention, but it'll be alright. Um I could heal her. Um but I'm not going to. I don't think it's needed. Um it's like I could make them attack each other, uh, change them into a frog, maybe. Mm, I'm not gonna bother. I think it'll be fine. 
Let's go. I should try to pants with them real quick. I heard like right here. She should have better hit them from that distance. Put him there. Put him here. Put him here. He should better jump over that now. Yep. How close can he get? Right here. Okay. I think that's what I'm going to do. Uh, let's heal him. I'm going to activate it with him so they'll move that way. That way to get them room to go up there. Let's go. Oh, it's still in your move. Okay. Let him get behind. Let's her volley him. Taunt. Force for attack. There you go. Good job. She can start moving up now. Let's go get this and heal everybody. <clears throat> go get this uh, treasure chest. Moving them. Get this treasure chest. Uh, actually, let me see, let me see. I'm gonna start destroying this first. She gonna start getting hit immediately as soon as I start the by that archer up top. So, what I'm gonna do is, cause she gonna still be getting hit even right here. So, I'm gonna just send her back. Otherwise, she gonna take a whole lot of damage, and she don't have that much health to begin with. Wait for her to come back. No, her. Thank you. Let's trigger this. I'm going to throw him in there. Just to occupy them for a second. Get her in there. Volley him. Get him over there. Press for attack. No. Him in here. Stop him. Get him in there. Make everybody face him. Yep. Attack him in the back now. You attack him. Don't play. Hit him. Jeez. Good job. Good job. Right. You go up here and beat him up. Come on. Good job. Okay. Now right, what do we got? You got another save point over there. Or heal point. I never actually use it as a save. And we got a treasure chest up there. Let's go get that. Oh, let's, let's, just in case. Because it's by itself. I don't see the little... I don't see the little skull icon on the floor right here, but yeah, I see. Yeah. Nah, that's not who I want to put right there. All right, let's start it. Two people, three people. Get him. He's running. So you attack him. That's an archer, that's why. Now you're stuck. Open that. Archer's down. Oh, I hate when it does that. I was trying to move him again. Mm -hmm. 
Send everybody back. Let's go. Let's do a pilgrim here. Archer ran. I should have did this with the archer. Damn. How's he getting so far away? Oh, it's two archers. Let's go. You get back here. Oh my god. Now he's stuck in the corner, so. Soldier came out. That's from his, uh, let me see what that is. That's the regular little ghoul. That's from his uh, helmet. He has another one that could come out though. A uh, little pumpkin soldier guy. From, uh, from uh, his enchantment that I have on him. Let's go. I should have waited so everybody was a little closer, but whatever. Get him out there. Get him over here. Let's get that top going. In there. Out here. Let's get a volley going over there. Let's mobilize. Move him a little bit. In there. Get in the between. Yorn Ratniger kicks up the locked chest and picks a massive runestone up. This must be the thunderstone they speak of. I feel the satyr blowing through me. The thunderstone runes tell the story of the ancient feast of Thirstblood. Held during the stormy seasons, it honors the mighty Thor as he travels through the Gate of Giants to battle the ice giants of Jotunheim. Nice guy. I know I'm gonna skip these. It takes such a long time. Like if I press X, it's gonna actually just leave the screen as opposed to uh, just skipping to each little segment. But. Tomorrow our names shall become legend as we cross the border between the worlds of gods and men. The king boasts, taking another hearty slurp of mead. He looks at you with a smile. May Odin watch over ye, he roars, raising his cup to your cheering men. Anyway. You want to go outside anyway? Doing a lot of construction? Yeah. Here it is, see. Uh, Halloween spirit. 
provides a 15% chance of summer pumpkin worry when you are hit. That's why I had to look at that guy to see if he had a pumpkin on his head. If he had a pumpkin on his head, then it was from that. But instead, it's from that, his skull. Skull of hell provides a 10% chance of summer lost Norse when you are hit. Actually, it happens quite often. If you notice, it says 10%. And uh, fifteen percent because it's per time he's hit, so it's like it's, it, it happens a lot more often than you think. So you've seen that mission that happened pretty much almost every engagement, and it's happened multiple times in one engagement. Uh, perfect damage token. Let's give her another perfect damage token. Or do I give him a perfect damage token? Because he doesn't kill people quite as fast as he should be. At least I don't feel like he does. Hello. Hello. Mm, attack skill goes down by two. Damage goes yeah. up by three. My attack skill instead. I don't use her. She's trash. Uh, attack skill 56. Maybe give him the perfect damage. I hardly ever use him though nowadays. Give him this. And that armor. Uh, give him this health one. Yeah, I'll give it to her. Nothing in here good. Nope. <clears throat> Let's do this other story mission then. Leaving the wounded king in safety. Right. A blizzard is raging in the mountains. With thunderstones placed everywhere, the Hadron warriors are celebrating the wrath of Thor. As lightning crashes down all around them, nobody sees your men approaching. So it's either him or him, although they don't really fit the same roles. But he's just, with him having both those things on that helmet and that uh, room, he can take out, he can fight groups all by himself almost because he keeps summoning his own soldiers. So it's like that just leaves them. And honestly, I feel like I like him more than him. He just survives better. But I definitely don't take him because he just he does so much damage. Doesn't kill him as fast as I would like, but and she does so much damage. I think I'm gonna use him though because he's close to five. Yeah, he's really close to level five, so <clears throat> let's go. In the eye of the blazing thunderstorm, the Hadrons celebrate the arrival of Thor with plenty of mead, music, and brawling. Looks like that lightning can actually hit me. Kind of like uh, Runes of Thunder. Find and bring all the charged thunderstones back to the Hall of Thor. Pyro. Use oil bombs to burn down all the Hedrum guard towers. See, I was curious about that because when you pick up the oil bombs, I just always throw it at a person. It's never giving me an option to throw it at anything else. 
but now it's saying I can throw it on the towers. So we'll see how that goes. But as I was saying about the lightning, though, uh, there is a a mission you do where it's like you got to fight 20 waves of enemies, and on the the medium and the hard difficulties, uh, there's rounds where lightning strikes start to hit, like a thunderstorm happens. And so if you get hit by the lightning, it does a massive amount of damage. So it looks like that's the same that's happening here. Looks like I'll get hit by these lightning strikes. See, I was showing a little arrow right before the strike hits. So I'm going to have to pay attention to that too and move my people accordingly. Oh, see, that's another effect he has. Whereas when he get hit, he has a chance to... Uh... Why aren't you attacking this? What? He should get hit by that lightning. Oh. Let's go. Get up here. Stop him from attacking us. Looks like he set himself on fire there for a second. And I need an oil bomb to set this tower on fire. I don't see any though. Oh, she just got hit by thunder. I mean, by lightning. Jeez. It did do a lot of damage. Did like 20 damage to her. Um, still don't see any oil bones. Hmm. Attack him. Move over here. Volley. And what well, stop? There we go. Go there. Go over there. You here. Bali. My archer. Open that up. Open that up. Let's get this sharpened stone. He picked up a throwing axe. What the heck am I using a throwing axe for? A sharpening stone. Can't carry nothing else. Oh, good. Oh, you bomb. Okay, <clears throat> now go back out there. So I'll go set this tower on fire. Well, he did it. Okay. Um, I think I sent another one. Yep. Go get this one. Here, I think there's another oil bomb back there. That's gonna lead me back outside. <clears throat> All right, let's bring him to us. Uh, 
Alright. Cure, c'est tout tôt. Something you got something you got something. Hmm. All right. You use your sharpening stone or grinding stone. Makes the next attack do more damage. Hmm. Don't need that throw next one. I'm gonna keep it. Set up. Let's go. Whoa. Thought this was gonna go outside. It's a lot of people in here, jeez. They fighting each other? Oh, the music got loud. Ah, oh, why did it stop? It was like they sparring or something, and they drinking mead while watching. He's splash, he's splashing like the the cup in the air. That's so cool. That's so like neat how they have that. That the figurines are just like not moving. They're just figurines. Like how it will be like in the tabletop. You walk in here and it's just like you would be fighting all of them, all, although they would all stay in their same position they are now on the tabletop version. But I mean, that's really cool though. That's why I like tabletop games. But since it's a video game on console, as soon as I start it, they're gonna all change. But since it's so me and them, I'm gonna go ahead and set them on fire. Bali going out here. The top going. Mm. Nope, no one around for you. Move forward so he can't get in there. Boom. Yep. 
come over, get behind. Boom. Nice job. Another oil bomb, another mead. Who had that mead? He did. Let's give it to him. Go pick up this other mead. Give it to yourself. Get this oil bomb. Nothing else in here? Nope. Going down again. Up the map. I'm not sure what that did. I think that was like a full heal. Oh, okay. Let's go then. Ah, oh, dang it. I didn't do that. It's done, it's done. Let's see. It's so up down there, there's a door down there, but there's something over here too. Let's see. Let's see what's in this door first. Oh, nope, that door leads outside. That leads outside too. That leads outside also. Okay. Let's see. It's like it goes up outside. Oh no. This is another room. Okay. Okay. This stage is real intricate. Oh, I keep doing that. I forgot that's a full heal. What do I need this throwing next for, though? Throw him right now. In here. Get hair going. Finish him off. Get the move. Behind him. Good job. Good job. You touch him. You move in behind them. Move in behind them. <coughs> You make sure they stay looking this way. Good job. Where's this go? Outside, and there's my car tower. Oil bomb. Instantly killed him. Oh, that's the door I came out last time, isn't it? Yeah, I think so. Let's see what's down here. No, don't want him. It's a guard tower. Who was that? An oil bomb? Nobody. Wait, he can't pick it up. This 
oil bomb. Let me go outside. I'm gonna go down here, set this tower on fire. I'm not getting hit by lightning up there. There's a door down there. Let's see, what's this? I run the room stone. Ambush. Stay hidden. Ah. Bro, what the heck? Why ah. stuff hitting me so much all of a sudden? Three y'all getting there. Come on, go up there. the other side, okay. Tower. So, go back out this way. We need to go up there now. Oh. 
than that. Yeah. What happened to what? I put it in the freezer upstairs. It's in the freezer upstairs. It's two bag it's two bags of shrimp on the top of the door. I mean uh, scallops. You say what? No, it's two bags of shrimp in there. And it's two bags of scallops. Both the bags of shrimp right next to each other. Now. You're a ghost? No, you're a ghost. Oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're back too. That door lit outside. I ain't been up there yet. <clears throat> There's just a throwing axe. Don't want to pick that up. There's a figurine. Sure strike. Next attack deals 15 bonus damage on an attack skill. Yeah. Make sure it didn't have no cool down. Exit right there. Where's this go? No, this is all by itself. It's the other side. Okay, yeah. Try to come here first. Oh, I could've just been right there. Thank Down we go. Oh, some more can. The oil bomb. Although I don't need them anymore. Get him in front.
Oh, you wanna hide back there? Is it? Hmm. <laughs> Nobody got any meat. I used all those oil casts. I mean, uh, me casks. Accident. I think it's a stone out here, though. Yeah. I could have went that door down there. I got right here. entrance mission done did everything oh wait I gotta bring them back to the temple right where is that hmm. I gotta bring them back to the temple what that means. Um, back to the starting point maybe? This is it? Feel like it might be.
Gate of Giants. As Jorn Ratniger places the Thunder Runes in their place, the electricity sets the rock into motion, and an ancient passage reveals itself as a cold breeze slips through. Whoa. Staring into the cold passage, you feel the weight of your destiny as you venture into a realm of legend. Finally, you understand that it's you who will shape the tales of tomorrow. Lightning strike. 30 damage looks like it said. That's gonna be amazing. Oh dad. All this time I had my uh I was muted, didn't even realize it. Uh the new card, like I said, 30 damage. Yes. There's 30 damage to targeted enemy figuring. That's pretty nice. And 60 defensive skill for 10 seconds. That's pretty nice. 30 damage. Flames of God. Mm. Do like that because it opens up their defense though. Makes it easy to kill them. Gonna be stumping up and down this place because they be on fire. And this gets rid of somebody for five seconds. Lightning strike is nice though. I'm gonna try the sticks. I don't hardly ever use that that much. I just use it just because. I load up the five. See his little, uh, his base is like jumping up and down. He's like, you know, he leveled up. Uh, let's see, I did get a perfect damage token. Perfect attack skill token. Yeah, four, eight. Yes, sir. Two, three. These are better. Let's see though. Oh. 
going to her. This bow is not better. There's three, she gained 15 gold. I think that's why I'm getting so much gold. Because of this. Which works perfectly for her. The air is quittance. Because she's always at least three away. And she doesn't need any defensive skill because she's never in the thick of it. So. Gives her more attack. Health. Yeah, I can't change nothing on her. Let's see how many he has on already. That's not better. Gain five hit points. Yeah. Wait. Oh, that's the same thing. Yeah. Two, two, three, 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 two, three. That matches her style more anyway. This axe is not better. Not better, not better. Deep up nearby enemy figurines, negative two armor, negative five defense, skill for ten seconds. Yeah. One percent chance to knock back an opponent when you are hit. Hmm. This one gives me more attack skill though. Could use that attack skill. And it makes him move one more. Hmm. But a knockback ain't really beneficial for him. I need them to stay close to him. For the other guy to be beneficial. For him. But he's my defensive, so if I could bounce him back, then. Uh, he has less hits he's taken. Your opponent's attack speed by 100%. See, in this one, he, that's why he stays alive so long because they hit him because that shield of House of Heaven grow, and then all of a sudden they can't attack anymore for eight seconds. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm gonna try him with this. But that attack skill increase is nice. Let's get some more health though. Oh no. I don't know, I don't know. I'm gonna try it though. What's the skill I have with shield bash? Yeah, stun is them. 